A client come in and he was having a lot of lower leg shin splints, what he called it, and he couldn't figure out why they weren't going away. It wasn't really a shin splint at all, but he had sprained his ankle really bad the year before. What he had done is he had sprained his ATFL or anterior talofibular ligament. These ligaments, they connect the bone to the bone and they're a thick connective tissue. Their job is to create stability with movement. So when he sprained his ankle, he creates a lot of instability in here because these don't have the elasticity that muscles and tendons do. When they have been sprained multiple times, they become hyper lax, which means they've been overstretched. Anytime you have laxity in the ligaments and the ligaments can't do their job of supporting, and it puts tension up into the muscle structure above it and or below it, in this case, above it. And now he's feeling it here. Now, all of the muscles are working way too hard because it has to do the job of these ligaments that can't support this movement anymore. So they were treating him for shin splints, but nobody looked at the fact that he had had an old injury in his ankle. And to go into a heavy strength and conditioning program thinking that the ankle is gonna be okay when you don't rehab it back into its regular movement pattern, then you're affecting the rest of the body all the way up. So there's potential for back injury, hip injury, and overall, as an athlete, your efficiency level goes down.